Hello friends, welcome to DP Tutorials. Please subscribe to DP Tutorials and click on the bell icon for notifications. In this tutorial, let us learn about the usage of rate types in Primavera P6. As a scheduler, you might be requiring to maintain both the internal and external reports of your project. In Primavera P6, we have five different rate types. In this video, I would like to explain you the purpose of the internal and external rates and how to define the external rate type and setting the default rate type and assigning the resources. Okay, first let me show you the five different rate types that are available in the P6. Go to admin and click on admin preferences. Here you can see the five different rate types. If you don't find the external rate type in your primary P6, you can rename any of the five rate type field titles to external rate. Okay. In the latest version, we have this external rate by default. Now let us open my sample schedule, which is having only one activity of duration five days like this. Now go to the resource tab and select display all the resources. Customize the columns by right clicking and add internal rate and external rate. Click OK. Now the external rate column will appear in your resources tab like this. OK. Similarly, in the bottom details section, go to units and prices tab. Right click on the header and add internal and external rate by customizing. Okay, select the first resource that is inspections and in the bottom details, go to units and prices tab and enter an external rate as $100 per hour. Okay, similarly, you can add external rates for all the SN resources in your project. Next, let us set the external rate as the default rate type for new resource assignments. Go to project tab, select the current project. In the bottom details section, go to the resources tab. Here in the specified default rate type for new assignments, by default it will be standard rate for all the projects. Now from the drop down, select the external rate as the default. Now assign new resource assignments using our external rates. Basically, external rate can add all the buffer costs that would like to include whenever you are submitting proposal to the customer. Okay. In this example, now I am assigning the uh, say project controls resource to the specific activity. Now go to the resources tab and mention the external rate for this project controls resource as $100 per hour. Now. Whenever you change the resource rate value, you need to go to tools in the menu bar and click on recalculate assignment and click on recalculate. This feature will update the resource assignment costs. Now you can see the budgeted cost changing from $3,400 to $7,400 because the new external rate that is 4000 got added for the second resource that is project controls got it friends now that you have understood the concept of the usage of external rate if i put the external rate as zero and then recalculate it will show my value as 3400 which is nothing but my standard rate which will serve my internal project reporting and if i put the external rate value as 100 if i want to submit to the customer i will then again recalculate and the value gets as 7400 further i can use this for the external reporting for submitting it to the customer okay so friends this is all about the usage of rate types in primavera p6 i hope you have enjoyed this tutorial if yes please give me a like share and comment for further more interesting videos please do subscribe dp tutorials thank you friends thanks for watching